We use bases for exponentials as well, right? Do you remember, I'm just going to write something that's parallel to this. If I wrote this, which you're quite familiar with, back from like year seven days when you did indices, right? Here, you say, oh, I'm multiplying numbers with the same base. So that means you do what to the powers? You add them. When you multiply numbers with the same base, you add the powers. Well, remember how I said to you logs are like exponential equations, but from another perspective. Actually, the other perspective is from reverse. Okay? So here, when you add logs, you multiply this number. When you multiply exponentials, you add this. Multiplying becomes adding. Adding becomes multiplying. So because you're looking from two different perspectives, you get these two different results. In fact, this is so important, let's just write it down so that we get it straight in our head. When multiplying exponentials, that's what these guys are, stuff with powers up the top. So long as they have the same base, like this is 3 to the power of something and 3 to the power of something else. So long as they have the same base, we add powers. But down here, it's in reverse, because the same object looked at from the other side. It's like a coin. You've got a heads tail, you've got a tails, heads side, a tails side. I said head tails, didn't I? Um, when you're looking at opposite sides, instead of going from multiplying to adding, here we're adding, and that turns into multiplying. So when adding, not exponentials, but logs, or logarithms, right? Just going to write logs just because it's a bit shorter. When adding logs, and again, it's got to be with the same base, we multiply the numbers inside the logs. In this case, it was 5 and 125. In this case, it was p and q. Adding to multiplying, multiplying to adding. Okay. Now, you're starting to get a sense of, oh, okay, everything I know about exponentials will help, help me with logs. See that index law over there? There's another index law that goes with it, but it's for division instead of multiplication. Do you remember if I gave you something like 3, sorry, I just wrote a 2, 2 to the 7, and I said divided by 2 cubed. You're dividing instead of multiplying. So instead of adding, this is the opposite, right? What do I do? I subtract. I subtract. 7 take away 3. Okay? So therefore, dividing exponentials turns into subtraction. Say that again. Dividing exponentials turns into subtraction. So what kind of log law do you think would go with that? Being that we're sort of reversing everything. Yeah. Very good, in, in case you didn't catch that. It's just like this, but in reverse. If you are subtracting logs with the same base, then we divide the numbers inside the logs. Okay. So what would that look like? I need a bit more space here. Again, so I'm going to put this under the heading of laws. If instead of adding these logs, I am subtracting them, I'm not going to multiply. I'll do the opposite. I will divide. Bless you. P divided by Q. Okay. Now, please keep in mind, this is what I'm trying to get across to you. It's a bit slower, but I hope it works better. These things here are not just written down, etched in stone because someone said so. They just flow logically from what you already know to be true. right? And they're just making a shortcut of all of these operations rather than doing them all from scratch. Can we think of an example uh, with numbers that would work with this? How could we write, bless you, and a log equation that goes, say, with this guy over here? What would be equivalent? Yeah, what do you think? Log 5 of what, sorry? Uh, this one here, okay, yeah, sure. We're thinking about subtraction, right? 
log base 5 of 5. So in this case, what we expect is for this to be log base 5 of, what am I going to do to these numbers? Divide. So 125 divided by 5, that's 25, right? OK, now let's actually look at what the numbers for each of these things is. You already know this is 3, and this is 1. Is this, is log base 5 of 25, is that 2? It is. It works. Okay. 